Jack! Plastic crap! You're doing this to me? Who do you think you are, you piece of plastic shit? Oh. Oh. Bro, you! It is my favorite Alburo movie, it died. What else can I do? It's probably not plugged in. What? Damn. No matter. I can buy a hundred more. Now, Tommy. Each month, a freelancer sails into Vice City and moors his yacht. He sells his cargo to the first boat. I want you to take the speedboat and beat all the other shitheads to it. Then you bring the cargo here. Okay? Let me guess. You thought I could use a guardian angel. I'm just saying, you need to let me in there, my man. Now you can feed me all this lonely tough guy crap. But I know one day, I'm gonna save your ass, and you're probably gonna wanna kiss me. Wacko. <laughs> we got some competition! We hope you're enjoying pressing issues and the way it challenges your So Tommy, we know it was Diaz busted our deal. So why in the hell are we running errands for? The more we learn now, the less we have to learn when we take this town over. I like your style, man. Real friends. Money is important. It can be exchanged for goods and services, like getting a hip replacement or funding a starving child in Australia. I feel all covered with flies right now. Call us. Pledge your money. Give 10% of your income. That's all we ask. And for that, you know everyone can be educated on the important things we discuss on VCPR. 10% is a really small amount. I remember when I was volunteering in Central America to make myself appear less shallow. The native peoples would give you 10% of their land for a pair of... Watch yourself! They're coming from all over! Guys, head for Diaz as fast as you can! Eat it! Eat it! Sleep with the fish! The voice of unprofitable radio could be silenced. One day you wake up, roll over, and she's gone. You go into the kitchen, there's a note sprawled, the sound of a taxi leaving in the distance, a thunderstorm rolls in. It's a metaphor for my haircut, or this pledge drive. Yes, the pledge drive. Become a member. Only members or people with radios can listen to this radio station. Now back to pressing issues. Shouldn't we give out the phone number? Like I tell the children at the library I- There are gunmen on that daddy! No, you can't go to the bathroom and stop crying. That's good advice. Now back to pressing issues. Welcome back to Pressing Issues with me, Maurice Chavez. On our panel, we got the secessionist lunatic John F. Hickory, liberal rich kid Callum Crayshaw, and neo-fascist congressman Alex Trump. Gentlemen, welcome back. Let's start with you, Mr. Hickory. Why the F? For Florida. I'm a patriot. I've even got an orange group. More trouble up ahead! You want some of this? Public safety. How do we get guns under control in this city? By giving everyone hope, a dream of a better tomorrow, by encouraging people to grow their own root vegetables. What's the satisfaction of holding a gun in your hand when you could be holding a hoe, planting seeds in a peasant village? Keep your hoes and seeds to yourself. We don't need gun control. If you read the Constitution, it's a sacred document. Good shooting, my friend. You're a real proper grade A lunatic. Well, thank you. See you around, Tommy. Okay, Mr. Lance Vance Dance. <laughs>